Hello, I'm George Jordan, and I've lived on or around Halifax Harbour virtually my entire life. And I've always wondered how Halifax Harbour was formed, what secrets lie beneath its waters. And like most people who grew up or live in this area, I know a few things about Halifax Harbour. It's very long. It extends into the Atlantic. It's ice-free and deep and contains various areas such as Bedford Basin at the head, the Northwest Arm and Eastern Passage as appendages, and an outer deep water area. We've all heard stories in Halifax about a possible tunnel that runs from Citadel Hill to George's Island. We've also heard there's a big crater which was formed by the Halifax explosion. It's even been said that Halifax Harbour is the world's largest ice-free harbour. The new technology that we used in Halifax Harbour called multi-beam bathymetry is a lot like draining the water, flying over the area in an airplane with the sun setting, and you see all of the features on the seafloor, all of the attributes of the seafloor, including shipwrecks and channels and hills and valleys. These things are very difficult to image using standard technology. So multi-beam bathymetry was quite spectacular in allowing us to see more detail in Halifax Harbour.